Today on the Stay at Home Chef, I'm showing you how to make easy corned beef and cabbage. I'm gonna show you how to make it both on the stovetop and in the slow cooker so you have two tricks up your sleeve when it comes to corned beef and cabbage. To start, you'll need a corned beef brisket and you can see the spice packet inside. You'll need that too. For the stovetop, you'll need a large pot with a lid. You'll wanna place your brisket down in the bottom. Then we're gonna pour in four cups of beer and I'm using Guinness today since that's appropriate for an Irish dish. You can also just use beef broth. Then you'll sprinkle that spice packet in there. I also like to add in a quarter cup of Worcestershire sauce. Then we're gonna bring this to a boil on the stove. Once it comes to a boil, you wanna pop the lid on and reduce the heat to low and let this simmer for 40 to 50 minutes per pound. So for most briskets, this means about two and a half to three hours. When the meat is tender, it'll be time to add in our veggies. I'm going to add in some small baby red potatoes. You could also use larger ones and just cut them up or Yukon Gold. You'll also need some baby carrots and a large head of green cabbage. What we'll wanna do is cut this into wedges. So start by slicing it in half. Then we'll take each of those halves and we'll cut into large wedge chunks. The first vegetable you want to add is your potatoes because they take longer to cook. So we'll slide those in. Then you'll pop the lid back on and let this cook for about 15 minutes before we add in our cabbage and carrots. Then after 15 minutes, the potatoes will start to get tender so we can add in our cabbage and carrots. Slide those in there and kind of fill up the whole pot. Season with salt and pepper, then pop the lid back on and let everything finish cooking until it's tender, which will take about 15 to 20 minutes. Then you'll be able to pull your meat out, let it rest, and then either slice or shred it and serve it with as much or as little of the liquids as you'd like. Now for the slow cooker, it's very similar. Place your brisket into the bottom of a six to eight quart slow cooker. Pour in four cups of beef broth or beer. Add in a quarter cup of Worcestershire sauce and sprinkle in the spice packet. Pop the lid on and cook on low for five hours. After five hours, it'll be time to add in the rest of our veggies. You don't wanna add them in too early, otherwise they'll get mushy. So we'll pull the lid off and I'll add in the potatoes, the carrots, and all of those cabbage wedges. Season with salt and pepper, pop the lid back on and continue cooking on low for another five hours. So it will take about 10 hours total in the slow cooker. Then just pull out your meat. It should easily shred, especially when it's made in the slow cooker, and serve it up with as much or as little of the liquids as you'd like. You are ready to eat. Thanks for watching. You can find the full written recipe in the video description. Be sure to subscribe, like, and follow, and check out the rest of my videos where you can find hundreds of restaurant quality recipes you can easily make at home. See you later.